Inflation deeply impacts the middle class and is the top public concern replacing COVID. High consumer prices are hitting hard on the middle class and by extension the poor and the near poor, widening the income gap as people in the middle slide down the ladder. Alisa Quartz said that 51% of the population define themselves as middle class. She added with jobs lost and costs going up, inflation is still especially tough for the middle class despite a rise in minimum wage. Penny Wang said that it's important to plan around inflation in terms of budgeting, saving, and shopping. She added that if big budget items need to be bought like cars, then plan ahead and buy those that are affordable and within budget. Use reward cards and stock up on groceries to save the most money. The other biggest tip she gives is to wait. If items that need to be bought can wait, then it's best at this time to do just that. The other biggest tip she gave is to wait. If items that need to be bought can wait, then it's best at this time to do that. Josh Bevan predicts that by the middle of 2022, things will get better as the supply chains will start to unchain and economic activity will also de-link from the pandemic and will continue to create jobs.